Hey everybody, it's Curtis over at the Noise Asylum, and today I'm going to be talking about one of my current favorite artists, and he has been a favorite artist of mine for a couple years now. I gotta thank Tosh the Drummer, <laughs> the super creep homie, um, for turning me on to his stuff because I believe he did Outcast Radio with um, Nathan, and of course I'm talking about Nathan James, who is bringing new metal back and um, revitalizing it and also making it a new new metal, which is NU NU metal. Um, he's definitely doing something a little different than uh, the groups that uh, popularized uh, the industrial and new metal scene. Um, you know, he's got hip hop aspects of it, you know, alternative rock, you know. I don't really want to say he's mixing any pop elements into it. I mean, just because <laughs> I've heard how he thinks of the music industry and, you know, what uh, some people are producing. And, you know, he wants real shit. And uh, from the most part, uh, a lot of that stuff I hear nowadays, is it ain't real. Um, but it sells. Um, you know, like in the group chat, they were saying, if Kids Bop can remix it, you're good. <laughs> But, um, I mean, he's doing killer things. I mean, I've been listening since to him since uh, Akasha and uh, Appetite, which I want to say Appetite uh, came first. Um, I could be wrong. Uh, it just had a killer video, and I mean a killer cover. I mean, when it looks like you're wearing somebody's face and you're holding a chainsaw on the cover, I mean, when? And then um, Queen of a uh, Queen of the Damned reference, uh, and you got an, you know, an album cover with that on it, and you're a metal group. I mean, you can't get any better than that. I mean, it's killer fucking songs. And then I mean his photography, and you know, I don't know if he shoots his cover photos. I don't. I never ask. I've been meaning to ask. <laughs> But, I mean, they're all phenomenal. I mean, even the new one, which I'm not even going to say what it's called because I don't know uh, if he's ready to put that out there yet, but it looks killer. I'll say that. It looks fucking amazing. Uh, I want to say I got the new song pre-saved. Cannot remember because I had the hardest damn time ever doing it with OK OK, and I don't even know if that one ever went through, but it is the most played song of the week with over 420 streams, that number was not intentional whatsoever. But that's the grand total of how many times that uh, it, I listened to it. <laughs> but, um, and that's over half of the streams that are noticed on whatever the app's called with uh, Scrobbles, Squabbles. Um, which I know there's more than that. Uh, that's just what the people that use that app and the reason why I use it is because it keeps track of what I've been listening to and how many times I've been listening to it. And uh, out of the, uh, I want to say 720 streams that I've had this week, we're 400, we're okay, okay. Um, which was really cool because he was the most streamed artist, had the most streamed track and the most streamed album, which it, it's a single, but that's the way it was categorized on the app. So he was on the top of the board all across the board this week and um, probably will be this uh, the next week coming up too. Um, Royal and the Serpent came in at a second, but it, it wasn't even close. <laughs> um, but that's just because I'm helping him and getting the streams. I hopefully, you know, the fact that that one day I put it on repeat before I went to bed. I hope all them streams count. I do not know how it works. I'd have to ask him. Either way, that's how the number got so high. Because I only average, you know, a few hundred songs a, a week. So, uh, it was damn near double. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, it's killer stuff. And I mean, he's put out a lot of killer stuff. And, you know, the Chain Gang is growing. Chain Gang. And uh, it's a big family, and I'm excited to see uh, where that cut, where that goes. And um, you know, he's just a killer dude, and uh, he knows me by my first name now, not just the Noise Asylum, which is awkward as fuck for me. 
because the only one that calls me by my name is my mother and when I'm in trouble. Even though I'm 23 or 22. But uh, yeah, this is just a short video about him and uh, I'll get in more into it uh, next time. And uh, y'all have a killer time and just keep on rocking and I'll see y'all on the flip side. She was leaving me, my sister thinks I'm the devil now Cause I'm tied it up and I'll give a fuck